wild match there. It was a lot of twists and turns. Um, what was your uh, takeaways from, from, you know, a big win really in terms of beating the number two team, right, team in the country right now uh, early in the season? First off, as you just said, that, that was a tremendous team, Georgetown. Um, and, and as you said, twists and turns, what a tremendous response by our guys. Um, consecutive goals were, were tremendous. Um, and then we, we suffered a lot in that second half. Um, so I think the biggest takeaway is a question mark is the personality of the team. And uh, you're, you're always concerned, you know, how ready are you for the start of the season? Are you going to come together? We've got, you know, 18 new guys on the, on the team, and it's, it's a whole new thing. But the, the fight, the collective fight, the collective, you know, team play by the guys, the willingness to suffer and, uh, you know, to stay together through all that, that's, to me, that's the ingredient, you know, it's so hard to coach. You know, you can, we can fix the other problems that, or the other issues that we have. But if they're going to show that they're willing to do that as a, as a group together, then, you know, it will be a, I think it'll be a really good season. This group tonight, I mean, in terms of being able to respond quickly after giving up a goal, um, did you have that kind of confidence come, you know, so soon early in the season to, that they would be able to respond like that? And obviously Berton uh, leading the way with the goal and assist. Yeah, no, I, I mean, you just never know. I mean, that's that's the, the good and the bad of the college season. It's, it hits so quickly. We haven't enough preparation time. Um, we've only scored one goal in our first two games, so it wasn't like we thought we were going to be pounding in a lot of goals. So that we found that, like as you said, Breton had a tremendous match, particularly in the first half, and you know the finish by Val was was, was tremendous. And we had a couple of ones we left sitting as well. You know, mm -hmm. they they made some great saves, but we left a couple sitting as well. Yeah, and defensively, uh, you pretty much overhauled your back line uh, and went with uh, a senior keeper who's been with the program. But what were your thoughts on uh, their performance tonight? They did a great job. I mean, um, yeah, I mean they, they're strong. They, you know, for, as you just said, we've got a, a new goalkeeper, four new backs. They just did a tremendous job. They came together. They, they knew their jobs. They, uh, they defended very well. They, and, and the box marking was good. They, uh, they held a really tight line for, was for the most part of the game. So I was happy with them. There's a lot of things to work on. But, yeah, they did um, a great job. In terms of your rotation and bringing in a number of graduate um, transfers, uh, student transfers, um, and starting one freshman uh, tonight um, at outside back, uh, Jackson, just what were your thoughts on some of the new players being able to jump in and play with, you know, your veterans like Jackson and are Noel? You speaking and of guys like like the, the Jackson Gilman, or are you speaking Jackson about Gilman, yeah. like, uh, are you talking about like the all you know, like Enriquez and Rosas and all those and, guys knew as well? Right. I mean, just I mean just getting those guys to just jump right in and uh, play with the with this group and to know what you know know what you want out of them too. Yeah, I mean, it's real early, but you know. To you know, one of the guys that played tonight uh, joined us yesterday. So it's like uh, <laughs> uh, we're it's very very young in the season. Or you know, there's enough of a culture on the team where they're starting. You know, they're able to teach the other guys on on the field and what what we're looking for. Um, we're still trying to figure out you know, the personalities of the team so we can you know use their abilities to the best in, within our system. Uh, turning to Monday. The backyard brawl, West Virginia. They beat Robert Morris one nil tonight. Um, just your initial thoughts on on that in preparation uh, for Monday. Well, another tremendous opponent. You know, they they went down. I think in PKs this this team in the NCAA tournament last year. They uh, they beat us uh, last year. They were just a tremendous team. You know, but same thing. You know, I gotta imagine that I haven't done my scouting on it yet. I don't know, but uh, they're probably very different, just like we're very different. So. It'll be a good game. I know the way they played last year was, they were, like I said, they they competed. They uh, played good soccer, um, or, or what I consider good soccer. You know, they were very dangerous at, at times, and they defended their rear ends off. So I expect more of the same. I, I hope that it's uh, you know our crowd can match what they did when we were there, and or and certainly what we did this evening. It was uh, tremendous to think of uh, you know that type of crowd here at. Uh, 
All right, Jay, thank you very much. Thank Congratulations you, on a season opening win. Yeah, at home. yeah. I'll take it. Thank you, John. Yeah. It was <clears throat> program record for crowd, 2,000 fans. Yeah. That was the most fans. Yeah.